Good morning, everyone. Y buenos días. <laughs> Good morning. We are in Costa Rica. We're going to spend the entire day in San Jose and we're very, very excited because we're going to be hitting up a lot of really cool spots. Before we do any of that, we're going to grab breakfast. And then walk, 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 walk. Look at my feet. Sorry, I'm kidding. Hi everyone, we made it to San Jose, Costa Rica, and immediately off the bat, it is so beautiful here. Yeah, love it. Love it. It made the entire trip <laughs> worth it. Which we will get into. The trip was a very long one. We started off in New York. Our flight was at 7 p.m. on Saturday. Um, we first flew to Charlotte, North Carolina our first layover it was only an hour and a half but we landed there around 9 30 places were already kind of closing Closed. down people were leaving the airport yeah i mean it turned out that we just decided to sleep inside the airport which was super like desolate nobody was in there empty nobody Um, bring this one. Put it there. 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 I like this. Under the tree, you would think you're in Costa Rica already. <laughs> Which made it kind of like okay to sleep in there and we found this really kind of tiny like nook behind a starbucks that had like lounge chairs so we decided to post up we watched eternals um the, for the first hour hour and a half of our very long layover and then we decided to call it a night which was we posted our first video we did post our first video um, as you know first year teachers you know things get busy and we were like you know we're gonna post so we landed at 9 35 in charlotte and our next flight to miami was until 6 45 in the morning in the morning so we were there for how many hours is that a six eight hours eight and a half hours oh then we hopped on our flight at 6 45 from charlotte to miami in miami around 9 30 again we grabbed a quick breakfast mm -hmm. and then we hopped on our flight from miami to costa rica went through customs really long line did Super not know so many people were gonna be there um they, we then picked up our rental car we drove to our first airbnb see we have a couch for relaxation we have a lovely wooden kind of like artisanal table where we've just been storing 
all of our small items, a chair to sit down, maybe read a book. My favorite part of this Airbnb. The real old time fridges mm. they have here. The ones where there isn't a divide between the fridge and the freezer. Mm. Um, so very vintage. Very vintage. And in here is where the freezer is. Store. Where you can store stuff. We're not really using it only to like hold a little bit of water, but very, it stays pretty cold. Stays pretty cold. Very vintage. Um, there are cupboards here, and there's nothing in there. The usual appliances. This is to make coffee. So you put a mug in here, and you put coffee grounds in here. It's kind of like a drip style coffee machine that is apparently utilized here in Costa Rica and a really cool part above the kitchen is up here there is a skylight mm -hmm. and it really brightens up this room because Definitely. it's really in the back and it doesn't have um, great lighting except for the skylight the ledge where spices and tea and sugar is held um, extra virgin olive oil balsamic vinegar we move slide over and you can see the, this is where the cups are stored we make a 90 degree angle turn we got cups not cups it's a bowls and other little goodies very large sink very large very handy burner let's make our way upstairs I think a great finish to this loft here in Costa Rica is the wood finishes everywhere. I mean, this is predominantly made out of wood from the door to the upstairs walls to the entire foundation of the loft. And as we make our way upstairs, we are welcome to the master bedroom. And you know what they say about bedrooms? This is where the dreams are made. I'm going to punch you in the face. I'm not including that. Why? <laughs> I'm a big sucker for lofts. I love lofts. And my favorite part of the loft is right here. We have a little desk space right here, right in front of the, right adjacent to the bed. We also have a beautiful view of this like outside patio with a bunch of flowers and plants with a lot of sunlight, which is amazing. As you can see from the closet, the closet is really deep. Like you could put a mattress in here. Very typical of New York City to have a bedroom of this space. Like I can fully walk in here. It is a very big walk in closet. Fully stand in here. A lot of room for storage. Get to the bathroom. Now, as we make our way to another wooden style door, we can see the very well lit bathroom that has a sink, a toilet, and a stand and shower. Water runs very clear. <laughs> I love you. Oh God, you make me laugh. What? <laughs> so cute. Great light in here. It is great light. It's beautiful lighting. Um, lots of wood, exposed wood. And it's comfortable for two people. Yeah. And we are pretty much within walking distance of the heart of San Jose. So there's so many restaurants here. When we flew in on Sunday, was everything was pretty shut down, but we found some really cool spots with great drinks. Yes, yes. <laughs> yeah, but now everything is open on Monday and it's really busy and everything is within walking distance, which is where we got brunch this morning. Anything else you wanna say? No, that's it. Yeah, our first night was comfortable we knocked out thank you for watching please like and subscribe and stay tuned for our next videos here in costa rica yeah we're out